If you're worried about whether or not small fiber neuropathy could be causing your dysautonomia symptoms, could be the tachycardia of POTS, could be the gastroparesis of dysmotility, could be the impaired sweating of thermal regulation, right? It will likely be kind of confined to one of those areas, or if it is a particular problem where you have irritation or um, infection within the nerves that is widespread, it might be more patchy in its distribution. But one of the things that can be really helpful to look at is whether or not those symptoms change when you're upright versus laying down. In other words, um, do you have loss of sensation of cold that, that usually happens with small fiber neuropathy? Does that change if you then lay down? Does it get better, right? So if, if the findings are better with taking you out of orthostasis, then we want to look up the chain a little bit more and look more centrally and actually see if we have a central problem that's causing a distribution error. It may look like small fiber neuropathy, but it may actually be that we're changing the output from the brain to those nerves. So that might be a helpful way to start to distinguish the difference.